It's my feel-good breakfast show. Yeah, you check it out. Yesterday, while the rest of us were freezing in the mother city trying to find some kind of way of warming up, one Daniel Radcliffe, in fact, a very bearded Daniel Radcliffe, was, guess what he was doing? Climbing up one of our seven natural wonders of the world, Table Mountain. Look at him. Look at that dude. I mean, he, what, what, what happened to Harry Potter? Huh? What happened to Wingardium Leviosa? He looks like <laughs> right now. But uh, it, it looks like he's enjoying his time in Cape Town right now, uh, climbing mountains and also I putting would in some walk great work. Past him. Would you though? I would not recognize Harry Potter at, I mean, Daniel Radcliffe at all. <laughs> <laughs> While well, he's here in Cape Town, uh, he's filming uh, a movie called Game Changer in the City. So, also very exciting to know that the South African film industry continues to grow. We're putting in the big stars. I, I mean, it. this guy, one of the, the biggest film franchises of our time, right? right. Exactly. So, good to know. Uh, welcome to the Mother City, Mr. Radcliffe. And then uh, our own Jane Sue is oh, writing a book. Have you heard that? I'm so excited about this. Yeah. So, she's writing a book that is called from Z to A-lister, how to get onto the social scene to document how she made her mark in South Africa after moving here from Asia. And she says that the idea came about um, that what you notice, a lot of her fans were asking her, how did we become like you? How did right. you get here? And the she's book is set to release in November. Always at all the different parties. She's, I mean, look, she's hanging out with Paris Hilton. I always see on her Instagram feed, she's in New York one minute. And, you know, people want to know, how do you get to have that sort of life? So I'm excited to see what's going to be in those pages. Yeah. So, like I said, it's called From Z to A-Lister, How to Get Onto the Social Scene. But I guess, I mean, a lot of people are already starting to do that by establishing names for themselves on social media, right? Exactly. And the more you tweet, I guess, somebody's yeah. bound to invite you somewhere and, uh, you know, take you to a party. <laughs>